Hello everyone, welcome to another video. Um, today I want to talk about a new topic that um, is about citizenship, about traveling for a Filipino, for um, especially a Filipina woman who is not able to travel to many countries because the Filipino passport does not allow to go to Europe or to America and I found a new way how to eliminate the bureaucracy of trying to get a visa for for example for Germany and I heard many stories that it's very hard to bring a Filipina to Germany or other countries in Europe uh, sometimes it takes uh, one or two years of um, uh, time to process all the documents and even then after so much time it's not sure that she will be allowed to get a visa and also for countries like Germany the woman also um, needs to learn German and pass a test so it's really really difficult even you're married to a Filipina it's very difficult to bring her to Germany and without being married it's almost impossible so I discovered a new way um, I found this because many Russian women uh, who are pregnant are going to Argentina recently and the reason for that is because they want to give birth in Argentina so that their child will be automatically um, an Argentinian citizen and get a passport. Uh, the reason for this is that Russian people are not allowed to go to Europe or to America so they try to get a new, a second citizenship from Argentina and if a woman gives birth in Argentina then the child will be, like I said, a um, citizen and the parents of the child are allowed to have permanent residence in this country so and after two years uh, living in Argentina the parents can get a citizenship as well so you don't have to find a work you just have to stay there and that's a very simple way to get a second citizenship and you don't have to work you just have to be there and Argentina is um, also poor country not so much like Philippines but it's um, they have a lot of economical problems and the uh, cost of living is not high in Argentina so if you find a cheap room for rent just 100 euro a month it will not cost much for the two years so that would be a chance for a Filipina if she travels with the foreigner boyfriend to Argentina and then stay there for two years after giving birth then she will get an Argentinian passport and the Argentinian passport is very powerful you can travel to more than 140 countries including countries in Europe like Germany you don't need to apply for visa you can go anytime you want you can stay in Germany for three months and that would be and that's uh, forever so it's like a two years investment for the rest of your life to have uh, you can travel wherever you want almost wherever you want um, USA is not included um, for the visa free travel for Argentinian but um, in my case it's not uh, needed but for American people if they want to bring their Filipina to um, USA 
then you can do the same process in Chile. But in Chile, you have to stay there five years to get a citizenship. In Argentina, just two years, but then you're not allowed to travel to USA. Um, the problem is that first you have to find a way to bring the Filipina to Argentina because as you know that uh, Filipina women are often not allowed to leave the country and um, the officers at the airport they will question everything and uh, if they have doubts then they will not allow the woman to leave the country and since the traveling expenses from Philippines to Argentina is very high because the traveling time is two days it's um, much longer maybe that's one of the longest flights you can find in the world because Philippines and Argentina are really far away from each other for some flights you have to fly first to Europe to Spain and then from Spain to Argentina so or you have to fly to Japan and then to USA and then to Mexico and then to Argentina so it's a very long travel and it could happen that you book uh, those travel and it costs maybe for two people 5,000 euro and then the officer at the airport will not allow you to leave with the Filipina and then all the money is lost so in this case I have also a an idea. In this case you should just try an um, inexpensive uh, vacation in Singapore or Hong Kong or Thailand, uh, a country that is um, um, very common for Filipinas to travel when they leave the country the first time. So the chances are much higher that it will be accepted. Even if it's not accepted the flight is not so expensive like to Argentina so you can um, you can like have a try and once you can leave the country with the Filipina then you can book from Hong Kong or Singapore or wherever you are you can book the next flight to Argentina and then the, of course the officers from Philippines cannot stop you anymore because you're already in another country Yeah, and the good thing is you don't have to be married to do this process of getting an Argentinian citizen for your Filipino girlfriend. And yeah, I just want to share this news. And I think for people who don't like to do all the bureaucratic um, hassle, which takes years and also a lot of money, then it's a good way it's maybe it's more expensive because of the traveling and two years staying in another country but yeah for people who like to invest the money and have a new experience living in a spanish country then why not you can um, have a second citizenship for the rest of your life and that's also very important because um, the Filipino passport is really not useful you can only travel to a few countries without uh, applying for visa but the Argentinian passport is almost as good as the German it's just maybe 14 or 15 countries difference for visa free travel so, uh, I would like to know your opinion if you have an opinion about this if that's a good idea if I miss something yep, that's all for today's topic uh, see you next week bye